neue Jahr läuft seit einer Weile und endlich steht auch wieder das erste Heimspiel in der MAP Arena an. Vor Weihnachten hat sich der Hans schon den Thomas Wimbush gewünscht. Leider waren so viele Veranstaltungen in der MAP Arena, dass wir das jetzt auf nach dem Jahreswechsel verschieben mussten. Macht aber nichts. Heute holen wir es nach. Von dem her, welcome Thomas Wimbush. Thanks for making it. Thanks for having me. Herzlich willkommen. And yeah, let's talk uh, about quick one about your last game. You had an impressive one with I think 29 points and seven rebounds, something like that, um, in 29 minutes. So shot up quite good to the end of the year. Um, what was decisive to have like a, such a tremendous game against Frankfurt? You know, going into the game, I was just focused on my job, what I had to do, and understanding that. In order for us to have a good chance of winning is play defense and you know and take good shots. So me going in and just understanding what I have to do first and that gave us a good chance to win. So how are the chances to have like one game like this one also on Sunday? Oh uh, it's really good. You know, if we just play the way we play, you know, I shoot the open shots that we always all of us are willing to take and willing to make and so I just feel like we're all confident to shoot the ball and everything will be okay if we do just shoot the open shots. Before we're talking a bit more about the Munich game, um, let's talk about the last um, couple of weeks. Uh, as I mentioned, we have had uh, three weeks off for not off. You trained and practiced and everything else, but like no games. Um, yet also a couple of days without uh, training, you uh, went to Austria and Switzerland. How did you enjoy your first I think, first trip through Europe? Oh well, yeah. Uh, it was uh, such like it was everything I expected to be beautiful. You know, it was just me wasn't being there. I just seen a lot of stuff on pictures and stuff. But me actually being there was actually really beautiful, and it was very entertaining for me to go out and see how other people live, and you know, just take it all in and understand that I can get to travel and stuff, and you know, it's it really good to do that. Um, is there something special you explored? What you were like before that you th said, okay, I didn't didn't know that like these things are in Europe like a special thing compared to your yeah the state yeah it's it's a few things that i really was surprised by you know just like just the small things like like people driving you know it's just like the sign the signs and stuff I'm, i'm just everything i'm trying to get familiar with it but like as of right now i'm i'm very comfortable with the signs and stuff like that what to do or what not to do so it's just you know it's a learning experience and also in this learning experience you said like okay i'm now way more familiar with the water with gas is there something something else you'll said like okay um, your yeah, food wise or drinking wise and was like uh, ex explored it in europe uh no not really the water was the main thing that i got to get used to because at first i wasn't really a, a big fan of it but you know now drinking this water i'm just kind of i prefer this water over than than the natural without gas water Okay, um, right now you're um, practicing once again uh, until or uh, since the 6th of January, I think. Um, so like two and a half weeks to prepare for one, not only for one opponent, like also practicing on your own and um, stuff on the team-wise. But uh, yet like a, a long way until the next game. And how hard is it to, to focus on like for two and a half weeks, like for, for one game and for the next steps? Yeah, you know, you just got to go into every practice knowing that we have to get better. So, you know, understanding that. Yeah, we're we're getting better on in, in, in the fact of getting ourselves better, but we got to get better as in preparing for the team that's ahead of us, and not just that team, but the teams ahead of, after them. You know, just by getting ourselves better. So, just understanding what we have to do that day and everything to take care of. So, if you should um, yeah should comment on the process the team has has gone through, um, how would you yeah not rate yourself yourself and the team, but like how do you think um, development um, goes so far? Uh, I feel like our development is, is is coming along very well. You know, each each day we're together is is is, is a is a day in in progress that we're all getting together, we're meshing together better, we're we're communicating together better, and it's just you know every step forward is is a, is a good day. So every step forward is a good day, and we um, hope to make a huge step um, on Sunday because we want to get Munich their first defeat uh, of the season in the in the league. Uh, what makes you comfortable to look forward to have like a home victory against this, yeah, as you said, good team? Uh, just being confident, you know, in the, in, in the teams that we play against. Because I, the guys that I'm playing with now, you know, I have every confidence in the world with them. Just going to battle with them every game, you know. So just understanding that we are who we are, and whoever we go against, I feel like we have a good chance of winning. So uh, 
like a little percentage kick for Sunday with the home home um, court, or is it like you're feeling such a good rhythm it doesn't matter to you so you're on a home court or a road trip or whatever? Uh, having a home court is definitely a, a good thing to have for sure because we have a crazy atmosphere here. The the fans are unbelievable. Um, but it, 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 and having rhythm is definitely a key thing too. If you're if you're feeling yourself that night, then it, no telling what can happen. So I'm, I'm I'm happy that we're at home though for sure. I said before, the one who is uh, standing next to me and is getting interviewed can wish for his follower to come comes next. So for the Factor game, we're looking for a player in our roster, and you could wish for. The one who's the pick. So, what's your wish for? Uh, I'm going to wish Jalen Smith to come next after me. So then, uh, we're having uh, Jalen for the Fechter game and um auch jetzt wieder ins Deutsche zu um, zurückzuwechseln. Euch bis dahin natürlich nicht bis zum Fechter Spiel, sondern schon bis zum München Spiel eine weitere gute Woche. Wir sehen uns am Sonntag, dann hoffentlich mit einer weiteren Winbush Show und um, einer weiteren Siegesrunde. Thank you, Thomas, for coming by. Thank you for having me. Schöne Woche.